take these gorgeous emanations of life, right? These gorgeous emanations of life, Spencer. We were supposed to bring them into the entrance, right? You have the Devir, which is the altar, and then you have the Heichal, and then you have the Kodesh Kodeshim. And you're supposed to enter with these gorgeous, gorgeous little lives, Spencer. And you were supposed to take, on this day, in, it's in uh, Leviticus 16, Achrei Mot, the Torah portion that we read today. Because Aaron's sons brought something that God didn't want, God killed them. So basically Aaron's boss killed his sons. And then Aaron, right after that happens, is told, okay, I want you to bring a young bull, a ram, and two goats. And you gotta do it alone, and I want you to wear this fancy linen outfit. And you're gonna come into the temple, and you're gonna bring them as sacrifices, right? You got this? This is the Avodah service. So, yeah, all bulls are that well behaved, especially young ones. <laughs> and so he would stand before everyone, and they would praise, and there were the, the Levites singing praise and honoring him, and he's putting his hands on them, and then he is single-handedly going to take that animal, put it on the altar. It actually is a beautiful image right now of you looking like the altar. And then looking into its gorgeous eyes, raising his hand, and in a simple motion, taking the life out of these incredible creatures. But there's something really interesting about it because most sacrifices, actually all sacrifices during the year go to who? Who are the sacrifices to? Who do we give sacrifices to in the ancient world? God, God right? Yeah. Well, guess what? There were two of them. They were stand-ins for us. And one of them went to God. And the other one, Spencer, was given a red thread, put on its head, all of our transgressions, Ave Rot, would go on that goat, and then Spencer, we'd take it to the edge of a cliff, and we'd throw it off as an offering to Azazel. Now I want to ask, what is Azazel? Azazel, anyone? Is it God? No, it's like the opposite of God. Azazel in the ancient Near East was a demonic goat demon. So we bring an offering, we take all of our transgressive behaviors, we put it upon this gorgeous life, and then we take it as a sacrifice, and we give it to the devil. They're totally upstaging this experience. <laughs> Isn't it completely, like, wild, right? So what we're here today to explore, the other thing that happens in the Avodah service and in the Musaf service is the Grand Delenu, a posture that takes us down through um, a beautiful, a beautiful kind of sun salutation pose. And so those two things together is where you get goat yoga. And what I'm hoping we could do today, if you look at the goats, I spent some time with goats, they're incredibly human in their, in their character. Right, Masa, you agree? They're very human in, in the way that they interact. And so what better stand-in for us? And actually, from this goat that goes to Azazel, we get the concept of the scapegoat, right? The goat, like the thing that you say, oh, it's their fault. So you can see how even language, the etymology of language begins with this tradition. And so what I want us all to do is find a place, we're gonna get with the goats in a second, but just find an inner place where we could say, okay, that's why I'm here. I'm here to have fun, I'm here to tell my friends and like Instagram, I did goat yoga on Yom Kippur. But really, why we're here is to say, why was this animal sacrificed for me? And what does it feel like to feel intimate with an ancient tradition that has been supplanted by a symbolic liturgy of what once was? That's why we're here to connect our liturgical tradition today with our ancient tradition of the priestly offerings. And there you have it. She's like so into it. She's like, right? What does it mean to give this life for my life and for my screw-ups, right? I miss the mark, he dies. And with that, Galit, right? let's get into a flow. That was a really cool way to step into this. <laughs> and then it became barbecue. Oh. That's the one that
went to God. <laughs> 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 